Hey guys, this is Second Jun Wen. Today I will be showing you how to install the One UI 3 beta on Galaxy Note 10 Plus without a computer. Big thanks to T-Shock for taking his time to download this official beta and sharing it to the community. This wouldn't have been possible without him. Anyways, make sure your model number is SM-N975F. It runs November update with the last build number of DTJ4. Otherwise, this will not work. If you're not having the November update, then you can manually update it using Odin. Do note this is a beta and not a finalized version. You will be expecting bugs here and there. Also, you will not get OTA updates, so you will have to wait until new beta comes out and follow this video as a guidance. Or you can downgrade your phone back to One UI 2.5 if the binary number is same to receive the OTA updates. If you are using the device for work, then I advise you not to install this update to avoid inconvenience and incompatibility issues. Last but not least, make sure you have got SD card and a space of 2GB. If you don't have SD card, you can follow the ADB process provided by T-Shock. Important information by T-Shock before you update, you will not be able to go to recovery mode by holding volume down and power button. Rather, you have to use ADB program, which you need a computer. The performance is smooth and responsive. Battery life drains a bit more, but totally expected. This is the first beta program anyways. Safety net test fails, so the application that requires it may not work. So one of the two that T-Shock has found was Google Play and Netflix. Samsung Pay works fine, fingerprint works fine and much faster than before, and you have the face recognition. Without further ado, let's get started. First up, open the link which you will find in the description. I have already renamed the file just to speed up the process for you. Now press the button to download the file. Now once your file has been downloaded, just go to my files and then type up update.zip and then simply hold and then press on move. Make sure that you have SD card and then simply press here and then move it just like that. Now shut down your device. Hold volume up button and power button simultaneously and release it when it vibrates. On the recovery mode, locate update from SD card using volume button, then press power button to click. Locate your update.zip file and click on it by power button. The process will be 15 to 20 minutes, so leave your phone alone and charge if your phone is low in battery. Once the process is complete, it will automatically restart and load up your device.
that's basically it. Enjoy One UI 3 on your beloved Galaxy Note 10 Plus. Do make sure to subscribe for more guides when new update comes out. Also like and comment below if it worked for you. Anyways, peace out.